Emotionally immature women often make the relationship all about them. They hardly make compromises. So when you ever notice this behavior or subtle sign with a woman that she's never going to make compromises for you, it is a woman who is emotionally unavailable. A woman who is emotionally immature can hardly have good communication with you. As we know, communication is the key to every successful and a good relationship. So if she is emotionally immature, she will always often find it difficult to make compromises you will have to be the one to always provide her with good things of life. Her needs must be met. Her wants must be met. But she can never give you a return because she feels she's the only one that is supposed to be getting. She's not supposed to do anything for you or she's not supposed to give you anything. Once you notice a woman is selfish to a fault that she only thinks about herself and her alone, she can't think of you or anyone else. It means she is emotionally Im immature. A woman who is mature often thinks about people who think about her. She often sees you as someone who she needs to reciprocate what he does for him. If she is always seeing you as someone who she can, she doesn't owe you anything, but you owe her, you're supposed to be doing just for her and her alone. It means she is emotionally immature. Run away from such kind of a woman. She never takes accountability and always plays the victim card. Anytime she does anything, it is never her fault. Most times they even blame you for the things they do. They will tell you, no, it is your fault I did this. It is your fault I did that. It is your fault I'm not happy. It is your fault I went there. It is your fault I went there. Any woman who does something, who hardly take accountability of her actions and who always shift blames. And most times you will notice they always play the victim card. It is someone that did, that made them do what they did. You know that she is not emotionally mature. Any woman who is emotionally mature takes accountability. When she does something, she knows she did it. She will always come up to apologize. But if she is emotionally immature, it is difficult for her to apologize. She will always be defensive and she will always be manipulative. Whenever you ask her a thing, it is someone that made her do it or it is something that made her do it. She is emotionally immature. She can't control her emotions, always throwing tantrums. Whenever you can't have a reasonable discussion with her, whenever she does something and you want to correct her, it must always end with quarrels. It must always end in disagreements. It must always end with fights. She will never want to take her correction. And if you insist that those things are things you don't want, you will see how she start throwing tantrums like a child, a year old child, four years, three years children. You see her throwing tantrums. Sometimes they even throw things when they are angry. Most times you see them, they will even want to raise their hands. Any man who raises his hands on his woman is a man who is emotionally immature, who is not really mature. And any woman who does it with a man is a woman also who is emotionally immature. And do not be in a relationship with any woman who has ever raised her hands to you. You as a woman, never be in a relationship with a man who has ever raised his hands to you. It is something if a woman feels she's not getting what she wants, she can discuss. But in a woman like this, she can never sit down to discuss anything with you because she feels she's always right. Everything she does is good. She is. She can't think straight. It takes maturity. It takes a woman who is mature to really have good communication with you. But a woman who is emotionally immature hardly have that communication. So you understanding her and she understanding you, it is something, it is a pull. Two poles that can never meet. Two lines that can never meet. So you see, whenever you want to have good communication with her, it is something that will never be possible. Because every time you want to start, it always ends with fight or quarrel even before you start. So you can never have good relationship with such kind of a woman because she is emotionally immature. Always stay surface level because she doesn't want to be vulnerable she doesn't want you to really know her. She doesn't want to talk. She doesn't want to. She wants to stay surface level. And if she stays surface level, you really want to go deep with her. 
you can never do it because she needs to allow you she needs to be herself around you before you can do it but if she is not she just she wants to be in, on a surface level there is no how she will get deep connections with you you can never go she can never get deep connection you can never connect with her in a deeper level where she gets to share everything she she's going through where she gets to share where she gets to tell you things where she gets to make you make funny things make you laugh most times she's often moody most times she's often she's often in her own thoughts most times she's often always unhappy always sad because she is emotionally <laughs> immature so that maturity that shows her that you need to live your life you need to be happy at least for yourself it is not there every time she's thinking about the things you've done to her even when you want to have meaningful discussion to, with her she's always bringing up things that has already passed things that has happened four years ago five years ago in order to make that relate that discussion not to be efficient, not to be effective, not to really hold or not to really happen in a good way or not for you not to really have good communication with her. She can never have good communication with you. For a woman who is emotionally unavailable or immature, she will never have good communication with you. You can never get to discuss with her, tell her things that are happening in your life, without her turning everything upside down. So if you notice a woman like this, it is a woman who is emotionally unavailable or immature. She is not mature to really think. She can't really think. It is just about what she feels, about what she's going through, about everything must be about her. So if you notice it, don't stay and say, oh, I'm, I'm going to change her or she's going to change. She's never going to change. That is who she is. She's always highly judgmental. When a woman is judgmental, she can't see good in anything. Everything anybody does, it is always bad. Any woman who sees bad in every good that comes, you see somebody did something good for her now. She will always reason it as a bad thing. Because she feels, because she can't give, she can't be herself, she, she, can't, she can't do good things for people. So when a person tries to do good things for her, she's always seeing it as a bad thing. She will always judge you based on what she thinks, based on her imaginations, based on her feelings. She always judge you because she feels, when I can't be good like this, is it possible for someone to really be good? Someone cannot be good. And most times, women like this are often seen as gossip. They often say, yes, most times you discuss about people, what they did to you, what happened between you and people, but always condemning people, always saying the bad in everything someone did or someone say. It is someone who is emotionally immature. So if she is like this, it means she will judge you even no matter how good you are to her. No matter what you do for her, she will never, it will go unrecognized. It will go unnoticed. It will go unappreciated. So if she is like this, you notice even around you, people around her, she's always judgmental. She speaks ill about people whenever she wants to talk. There is nothing good she will say about someone. Even when those people have been good to her, have been kind to her, it is a woman who is emotionally immature. Those things she does to those people, she is going to everly do it to you. Because this is who she is. This is who she is. Most times you see, that's where you start seeking validation. Because you feel, maybe you're not doing too much. You're not doing enough. That's what you feel. So you start seeking validation. You start asking her, oh, do you love me? Am I doing it right? And whenever you ask a woman this, Know it that you've already filled, you've already filled the relationship, you've already filled it with her. She will never, she will never, she will never see you or treat you right. So those questions are things you should not ask. If she really likes you, you will see it in her action. Her action comes to play. You will see it in all she do, the way she treats you. That is how you see it. But if you always on in, if this is the question is always in your mind to ask her if she really likes you, she is because you know she really do not like you. And most times it's because she is emotionally immature. She cannot really give what she don't have. So these are the five things you notice with a woman who is emotionally immature if she is emotionally immature you will notice these five things from her so you will quietly withdraw yourself 
until she realizes her mistake and she's willing to turn a new leaf and she's nearly really need she needs to change from it that's the only time she will change and come back to you a good person this is spell solution the goal is for you to stay in a healthy relationship and a healthy marriage do what to like drop your comment what you think about this video and if you see my video for the very first time do not forget to follow my page follow my channel for more videos like this and don't forget to share this video to your families to your friends you never can tell the multitude of men you will really be saving and helping with this video thank you